Hey guys, it's me, X Music Cheese X here, and welcome back to more of Let's Play Earthbound. Last time we got through the underground tunnel that the zombies were guarding and made it, well, around the river bend and into another cave that has some strange music. Yeah, this is kind of different. But supposedly the village that the old man was talking about is right through here, so let's go on through. Okay, maybe it's the next entrance. This music is awesome. Hmm. But pretty weird and you're gonna meet my favorite character in the entire Mother series and pretty much everybody's favorite character in the series. So here it comes. I want to introduce you to Mr. Shadow. I feel grateful. I found me, Mr. Saturn. This place will all of Mr. Saturn. Mr. Saturn, huh? Well, let's go ahead and check out your houses. This is obviously a hotel. Do you want Samba? Do you? As opposed to, okay, and yes! Broken Air Gun became the Magnum Air Gun. You know, back in 8th grade in our science room, we used to have a um, air gun, and what happened is that we would always try to um, use it on pretty much everyone. Of course, unlike that one, it didn't cause any damage. So, anyways, let's check out that Magnum air gun. Much, much, not much better than the toy air gun, but it's better nonetheless. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and all healed and dandy. Well, not all healed because Paula still has a ghost. And this is my favorite Mr. Saturn, as you can see, like that guy said, all of Mr. Saturn. Well, this is my favorite Mr. Saturn. This is Dr. Saturn, who lives in a trash can. I'm Dr. Saturn. Saturn, I want to repair your body, boy. Do you want me to upload on you too? Uh, yes. And he hears our all status conditions. Yeah, I'm actually basing this off of the sound effects in Mother 3 of when they're... Well, their voices off of the sound effects used in Mother 3 where they're stuck in a totem. Oops, sorry for these little spoilers, but anyways. Anyways. Thank you for my time. There were many, many. I'm a very truly lost. I'm a scratch. And take a look! Presents on top of letters! And tons of letters. Letters? I mean, ladders inside. Red promoter, we're obviously gonna give that to Jeff, but later on, as soon as we have enough inventory space. Uh, if you, by the way, go into this cave, you can get a few items from the East trash can. There's a sudden gun gun spill inside. Basically increases your gun by one. A protractor, useless. And broken spray can. Give it to Jeff as soon as we sell some items. There is a shop in here. But if I haven't sold my tell bag, I could demonstrate that every time you try to use it, nothing happens. Few Mr. Saturns in here once through this cave. Nothing! Anyways, let's talk to this guy. Hey, what did I say? I might give you a special thing. Help me out, sir. I can't run the way back, boy. Bye, mother. An item, huh? Stay scary, my boy. I'm for fools. Can you see it, boy? Go on, mother. Don't scare me. Well, that describes 
pretty much the entire Earth bound going la 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 and then suddenly scary. Now this Mr. Southern that's walking around is required to progress in the game. You want to talk to this particular Saturn. Please, Saturn, please be on Grapefruit Falls. Grapefruit Falls, there must be a waterfall up the river. Grapefruit, what do you know? Grapefruit, see, say a password. Then some still pray for three minutes. Three hours? No, just three minutes. Oh boy, you have three little dollars, which was sixty four and so boy, we have seven one thousand seven hundred dollars, we paid for one of life. He's actually referring to the shop, not him himself. This up here is the shop. And this guy will have I love his tune. You can buy me, you can tell us too, and this is a boy and a roll for you. And basically, you'll sell a bunch of things. A bionic slingshot, do not get it. Despise it, flashing, do not get it. Tends to miss quite a lot. Which charm we will get? There's an ATM over there that actually spits out money, which is funny. Silver bracelet, pretty good. And red ribbon for Paula. Now, Sneed. Well, we do need to sell things. Sell? Well, first of all, we can sell that protractor. And only one dollar. Now, Snape, yes. We need to sell. We're gonna be selling quite a few things here. Uh, skip sandwich, calorie stick. We don't need a cheap bracelet anymore. $49, go ahead and pay us. Now Snape, or trade us in this sense. Since this is more of a bargaining thing with money instead of items. Wait, that's pretty much capital, um, capitalism. But anyways, for the nine Toyo gun, we do not need. 107, yes. Yes, and um, we need to sell. Let's see, what else we need to sell? Not the Franklin badge, that's a given. Though we won't need the Franklin badge. The Franklin badge is still useful for enemies that use lightning, so always keep that. Bottle work and say bye. Oh, nothing else to sell then. Nope. And goods, I guess we give that auto rocket to Jeff. And goods, I think Jeff is full of his inventory. Okay, well, we'll give the insecticide spray to Ness. Sorry that it's kind of boring here, but no oh well. Skip Saturn to Lost, skip to to Paula, because Paula is going to be more of an item singular. Any other healing items? Well, there's a protein drink, I might as well keep that out of Ness, because Ness is the, supposedly the oldest in the party. I don't really care that much for alcohol. Well, I don't drink it by the much. I mean, I'm under 21, but, you know, I tasted it before. Not very caring of it. We're gonna spread. He can obviously gonna give that to Jeff. Cause Jeff fixes everything. And anything else? Rust promoter, we gonna keep on this, might as well. You know what? Jar flying to me, give that to Ness. Ness gonna have all the key items. And now let's give that breath promoter to Jeff. Alright. So amazingly, Jeff is filled up in inventory. But Ness has just enough, and Paula has just enough inventory, so... Yeah, I guess we'll buy some stuff. Okay, buy our slingshot, we have no Great charm, don't have enough money, uh... 
Might as well go over to this thing that automatic teller machine. Again, I think it's funny how they actually print some money. And withdraw most of our money. Three thousand. Over three thousand. No, because it's just about three thousand. Why am I using old memes? Anyways. Okay. Great. Try and quick or get that. Do not. <laughs> Travel charm. Uh, that one is. Uh, are you thinking about that price soon? No. House need? Yes. Buy. Guess the. Uh, also get the great charm for Jeff, but only Paul again hold on to it. But first of all, let's get the red ribbon for Paula. Grab it here. Nice ribbon. That's for the floor. Yes, we'll take it. Thank you. I love that we actually says burden. Like he wants to get rid of this stuff. Great charm, we'll get that for it. Okay, silver bracelet, I guess we'll give him follow. Keep it here. 44 for 49 copper ribbon. Yes. That's good price! There, I took your burden and gave you money. Okay, silver bracelet for Ness. Very, very nice. Copper bracelet. That first thing. A snake. Place the next boy. Bye. And we'll get the great charm for Jeff. Anything else? No, just the bionic slingshot, which is actually crap. Flip here? No. Anything else? No. Oh, thank you. Thank you for taking my burden. Thank you for playing my game. Oh, broken eye, broken eye, fine, broken. Um, actually, help. Because I am here. Not after one use, okay, it can be used by everyone, so. Paula, you go ahead and take this bob. Hey, can you hold on for this, please? Thanks! I can't. It doesn't work very good without the animation, sorry. Equip. You go ahead and get that great charm. Very nice. I'm gonna keep hold of that trouble charm for Nath simply because it's. although it's weaker. It does prevent paralysis, so I'll just keep that just in case. By the way, what does this Saturn sell? This Saturn should sell healing items. Like, also sell stag beetle, basically stuns enemies. Beating a cheap bar, that's actually kind of interesting. Horn of Life, and Horn of Life basically heals, um, Horn of Life actually revives people when they die. So, Secret Herb... Mm, don't have enough of that yet. But, put it your postcard, basically you take by that and... You get homesickness. So, let's go ahead and deposit that on my cash. Sorry that this is kind of boring. And deposit, like, $1,000 or... Hello. 15,000. And we also, by the way, I want to take a teddy bear out. And start to express. I'm working part time. Good. I want you to deliver. When do we want to deliver? Only up to three things. Well, I want you to give me that teddy bear. As you can see, I saved up uh, quite a few items here. Actually, broken machine as well. Yes, select an item, and we also need a teddy bear. Nope. Bring a machine and teddy bear, is that correct? And good. Luckily, we have a little bit of inventory space here. I guess we give that rust promoter to Ness, I guess. 
Hold on, you can hold on to the teddy bear and you have a course will hold on to that broken machine. The broken machine we got in from Apple Kid. Maybe Jeff can be the better inventor and actually finish it. But wait a minute, this has no map. How will he find us? Well, he finds us anyways. Okay, here. Broken machine, teddy bear. Charge is 18. Yes, we can pay that. Good, Sam. Now, Paula has a teddy bear and the broken machine. We're just gonna give that broken machine to Jeff. And we got a little teddy bear. Yay! Oh, it's so cute. And ooh, there's a hot spring upside there that's full of pink stuff. But it's full of blood. No, just joking. But the ladder dude doesn't reach. What do you have to say? Cross our friends. Take him behind Faust. Why, why, boy? Friends taken behind Faust. I love that the teddy bear also has to climb down. That's essentially kind of cute. But yeah, this is real. Sorry that it's boring, but this is more of a preparation stuff going on. I guess I'll erase up on the hotel. I should have saved this part. I should have saved this part talking about the Thanksgiving dinner and the Doctor Who anniversary special. Jeff, you're gonna. <sighs> Couldn't fix anything. Jeff, you're too low of IQ. Jeff, you're stupid. But, uh, I should have talked about this thing to me. No, I always said that. What am I saying? But, anyways, I'm um, sorry that this has been much of a boring part, but here's something interesting. Those people! Those people! Everybody's favorite character is Master Simon! But anyways, and go free. Feel free about the comments about how you like about that voice, that Master Simon voice. Go ahead, feel free to comment. I dare you! Damn it! Comment! I need comments! Nah. I don't... I want to create someone, but... I'm not... I'm not specifically begging for it, but oh, what am I saying? There's really nothing else to do. By the way, the reason why I'm bringing the teddy bear is, well, you'll find out in the next part, but anyways, I guess I'm gonna save. I have quite a few items in stock. There's gonna be some items that you're gonna get at the behind the falls, apparently, but now I'm probably gonna just go ahead and use up the ceiling items in place, but until then, next time on Let's Play Earthbound, I guess we'll go over to Great Grove Falls, entering that password, and I guess I'll see you guys then.